What, What is up, everyone? Welcome to Candle Play. Hello, good hearts and God sense. My name is Simon, Good Heart VA, and welcome to our channel Canva Play. We make videos here in Canva Play to share Canva design tutorials, tips, tricks, and hacks that will elevate your Canva skills for free. If you are new here, be sure to subscribe and turn on your notifications just below this video so you don't miss out on every video we post here as we upload new videos all the time. All right then. Let me start our today's tutorial. In today's tutorial, I am going to show you how to create a broken glass portrait effect in Canva. To give you an idea, the broken glass portrait effect is a photo manipulation technique that involves superimposing a shattered glass texture onto a portrait or image to create a broken glass effect. This effect adds a sense of drama, depth, and texture to the image, giving it an edgy and unique look. The technique can be achieved using a variety of software tools, for example, including Adobe Photoshop and GIMP. Many tutorials are available online that provide step-by-step -step instructions for creating this effect. But the good news is I will be sharing with you today how to create this effortlessly in our favorite tool, Canva. Let's get into Canva and I will show you how to create a broken glass portrait effect. But before that, here is the design that I will create. I am now in a blank Canva design page and let's create a design. To start, get your subject image from photos or uploads. I will get mine from uploads. I will click this one and insert it in my design page. I found this picture online. I just took what caught my attention. I prefer to use this image because of its expression. A surprised woman holding a camera portrays a lot of emotion and story, especially if we will make this into a broken glass portrait later in this tutorial. Very captivating as I imagined it. The first step to do is to set this image as background. But before that, I want to change the background color of this image. So what I will do is I will select the image, go to edit image, and click background remover. As you can see, I'm using the old edit image editor in Canva, so don't get confused why it doesn't look like the ones with the magic eraser or magic edit features. If in case you want to use this type of editor, you can simply switch back by clicking the button found at the bottom part of the editor as shown in the screen. Going back, I will click this background remover. If you are a pro version user, you can automatically remove the background under edit image. If you are a free version user, you can use the free alternative background remover like remove.bg. You can find the link to this alternative in the description box below. If you want to have a Canva Pro account, I have a link in the description below that will give you access to 30 trial days of Canva Pro. Just click the link and it will direct you to Canva to process your trial subscription. It's completely free and you can cancel it at any time you want. Hassle-free. Once done, click Apply. To continue, after removing the background, we will now change the white backdrop to our preferred color. As for me, I want to change it to brown. So what I will do is I will select this backdrop. Head over to the color tile above. I will click this plus sign and I will type in here the hex code that I want to insert. So as for me, I will choose brown. I have prepared one. Number sign 5C2114. And then I will set this image as my background. I will double-click it 
and position it slightly at the center. Like this. Now, let us apply the broken glass portrait effect. We will be needing, of course, a broken glass overlay to achieve the effect. So what we will do is, we will now go to Photos and type in the search bar the keyword Broken Glass. Hit Enter. And you will see here so many options to choose from. So I will scroll down to find the exact image or overlay that I want to use. I think I'm going to use this one. So showing you the keyword, it says here, broken glass. I will click it to insert it in my design. Pro tip. You can also use the keywords shattered glass or cracked glass in finding broken glass overlays just like this one. To continue, we will now remove the background of this broken glass image we just insert. So using the image, go to edit image, click on background remover. Let's just wait for it to load. Perfect. Once done, click Apply. We will now move this overlay to our desired position in the design. I will resize and overlay this cracked glass image as if it's coming from the bottom left portion of this portrait image. Let me show you how to do it. Perfect. Finding keywords is hard and time-consuming, and you need to do a depth search and a lot more time to find in this kind of keyword. If you want to save time and find all the overlays, action brushes, special photo collections, photo series, patterns, textures, and mockups in Canva, we have created an ebook called Canva Bus Book. Canva Bus Book is an ebook of Canva search keywords with visual presentations that will make your designs look great and professional in less time. We have shared in this ebook all of the secret collection keywords we used here in Canva Play and even the new ones which are not easily searched inside Canva. So, what are you waiting for? Grab your copy now. Find the link to the product in the description below in this video. Going back, we will now do the magic. To make this effect more realistic let's duplicate this page and let's set aside this one for later going back to this original page we will now blur the image behind the broken glass so let's select this one and then let's go to edit image scroll down and find the adjust options click see all and you will see here the different settings under adjust. So we will now use or find the blur setting, this one, and change the setting from 0 to 30. Awesome, we're almost there. The next thing we'll do is let's download this blurred image and upload it back to Canva. So I will go here at the share button, hit the download button, and I will download it now. Thank you. 
Once the upload is complete, we will now get the image from uploads. Click it to insert it in the design. After that, select the image, go to edit image, and click again the background remover. Here's the trick. We will restore some parts and delete the other parts in this image. Our goal here is to retain the cracked glass overlay with the blurred image behind it. So we will restore that part only. Let me show you how to do it. I will now click done and apply. Let's just wait for it to load. Perfect. Absolutely beautiful and creative in my eyes. Let's now drag this image in the page we set aside a while ago. Then, I will now resize this image and occupy it to the whole page like this. Make sure it fits exactly with the glass overlay we placed here. After that, Send it backward and then lock it. Perfect. It's now already good with me. Done. This is now the final look of the design I created in Canva using the broken glass portrait effect. That's it! For more design inspirations, watch this. If you like this video, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and to be updated with our upcoming videos, click subscribe. Drop your comments below for the tutorial you want to learn next time. Before I end this video, I hope I inspire your creativity. I'm Simon, Good Heart VA saying sharing is caring. In behalf of Pinky Godsent VA, thank you for watching this till the end. Don't forget to hit that little bell icon so you don't miss out the next video with another exciting Canva tutorial. Bye guys! See you in the next video!